You've done an amazing job of setting up the point, running your opponent side to side. They give you that short ball, that aha moment in tennis. You get there, you load, and then you miss the ball. It's so frustrating. But don't worry, I'm gonna teach you how to never miss that short ball ever again. There are three main factors that go into hitting more winners on that short ball. And number one is making sure that you are making contact as high as possible while it's above the net. Once the short ball gets below the net, it makes it significantly harder to hit a very good shot because you now have the net as an obstacle. So you wanna get up there as quick as possible. You can take the adjustment steps once you're up there, but it's all about trying to take the ball at chest or shoulder height so the ball is already above the net. That's going to help you to create a more direct ball towards your target. Number two is all about having a little bit of margin. And to do that, you need a little bit of topspin. So you'll see a lot of people hit the ball super flat and the ball's always clipping the tape or it's going in the net. That's the reason why. You need a little bit of margin. You need a little bit of topspin that you're trying to hit so that you can clear that net with a good accelerated topspin ball. Number three, and this is very important, big targets. Too many people are going up and hitting the short ball and aiming for the line. The line is not very big. That is a small target. I don't care who you are. If you are Federer, you're gonna have trouble hitting that target, the line, over and over and over consistently. So if you want to hit more winners on your short ball, you actually need to make yourself have bigger targets. That means that you need to aim a couple feet inside the sideline and a couple feet inside the baseline. That's where you're aiming. That way, if you're a little bit off that day, or you, as you know, we all miss our targets by just a little bit, you're still going to make a great shot that's going to be very difficult for your opponent to get to. The thing is, is that you're not always trying to hit a winner on this shot. You're trying to hit a very good, decent, hard ball for your opponent to get to. And if they get to it, you're ready to put that volley away into the open court that you've created for yourself. So if you wanna hit more winners on that short ball, you have to get up there quickly, take the ball early. You have to make sure you have more margins by having some top spin on the ball. And you have to aim for big targets inside the lines. Those three things are gonna create much more success and be able to put away that short ball once and for all.